Now I want to explain to you a little bit about how a GPS works. Right now we're currently using the Garmin Nuvi 2595 LMT model. It's a fantastic model, very similar to a lot of the other models out there. So we're going to go cover a few of the basics just to give you an idea about how this GPS works. Here you've got your indicator uh, that shows that you're connected with the satellites, shows the signal strength. Actually we're getting good signal strength for being indoors. The car shows that it's in automobile mode, not pedestrian mode. Here you've got your battery power, you've got your settings, your apps, your volume, and a few and a couple of your main larger options that you're going to use on a day-to-day -day basis. The first option that I want to talk to you about is the where to option. This is where you're going to go to either search for a POI, a point of interest, search for a location, or to enter an address, a specific address, or even search POIs or points of interest by categories. Here you see they've got more categories. You can also save points of interest. That's great for if you're a, a hiker, or a biker, or even just driving around, you find a great spot, and, and uh, you don't know exactly the coordinates or anything, you can save it, and it'll save it to the saved. And then you also have your most recent uh, POIs, or points of interest, or places, locations visited. Uh, th that's always fantastic. Now, the, the most basic function is entering an address. Let's say you want to visit the Sun Suites Extended Stay Motel in Plano, Texas. It's going to ask you for the house number, which we know to be 200. You're going to click Done. Now it's going to ask you for the street, which we know as Rousseau Drive. Click Next. Now it's going to calculate and try to find uh, the, the mo closest uh, address similar to what we typed in, and it's finding right here 200 Rousseau Drive in Plano, Texas. That is correct. 15 miles away, so I'm going to click Go, and it's going to ask me if I want to start a new route. Yes, I do. Now it says calculating. It's calculating our new route from our current location, which is Louisville, Texas. Please drive to highlighted route. Yep, all the way to Plano, Texas. We're going to follow this purplish pink line. Okay, so that's real basic about how a GPS works. I can also use voice commands to stop the route or to actually choose another location. We've chosen a, a password phrase for the uh, voice command, which is gobstopper. Say a command. We're going to say this one. Stop route. Route canceled. So I went ahead and canceled our route. We can also do gobstopper. Say a command. Find place. Speak the name of a place. Starbucks. So now it's going to go Search ahead and find Starbucks. the nearest Starbucks select to our current location. Number. And then we can select a line. Let's do number three. Would you like to begin navigation? Yes. And there you go. It went ahead and calculated our route from our current location to the Starbucks that we chose.